Hello everyone, welcome back to Math Mood. Here we have interesting algebra problem, factorial problem. We have 19 factorial plus 20 factorial and plus 21 factorial. And right here we have an option. So the most obvious one is A, a 60 factorial, but this option is wrong. So we cannot add these all three factorials and we cannot write that the answer will be 60. So what are we going to do in our case? So let's simplify this a little bit. We all know that this 19 factorial can be written as 19 factorial as well. So let's write this 19 factorial right here. This 20 factorial is a product from 1 to 20. So we can write this 20 factorial as plus 19 factorial times 20. 19 factorial, it will be product from 1 to 19 as, and write our 20 right here. And write, let's write this 21 right here as, of course, 19 factorial but we need to write our 20 and times 21. So we need to write right here to our 20 and right here 20 and 21. And this will be the same. But take a look what we will have right here. We have 19 factorial, we have 19 factorial right here and right here. So we can factor out this 19 factorial. So let's do this. We will have 19 factorial and in parentheses we will have, from here we will have only one, plus from here as you can see we will have only our 20 and from here we will have only our 20 times 21. It will be equal to 19 factorial and let's add all of these in our parentheses so we will have 1 plus 20 21 plus 20 times 21. So as you can see we have 21 plus 20 times 21. So we can write this as, for example, x, if you don't understand, x plus 20x. So this will be the same. So if you don't know how to add all of this. So as a result, we will have 19 factorial. We will have 1 times 21 and plus 20 times 21. So as a result, we will have in our parentheses 21 times 21. And, and if we simplify this a little bit, we will have that this will be equal to 19 factorial times 21 square. And this is our, our answer. So right here we have 1 times 21 and plus 20 times 21. So as a result we will have from here 21x if you don't understand this x method. And moreover we can write this as 21 times 21 will be equal to 21 square and from here option option D. And this is our answer. If you have any question, if you have any suggestion, write a suggestion in the comment, write a question in the comment. Thank you for watching, subscribing, putting subs up and see you in the next videos.